Alright guys, what's going on? It's Reefly here. And uh, today, you know, I'm not doing a let- this is not a let's play, it's just kind of a video. Because I just wanted to show off this, uh, this game. It's uh, Shovel Knight. And uh, it's a pretty cool game. I have only played probably like an hour and a half of it so far. So not too much. Um, yeah, so I definitely I want to show off this game because it's, it's cool. It's a nice throwback game, and yeah. So I got Reefly here. A whole bunch of stuff I'll explain. But yeah. Okay, so this game takes a lot of inspiration from a lot of NES games and maybe a few Super Nintendo games. Uh, a lot of reviewers and you know just people. Overall, and then compare it to, you know, Mega Man, which you'll see uh, pretty soon. Uh, Super Mario Mario 3, I think, with the open world thing right here, which is probably the only comparison to that. Uh, DuckTales, which you'll definitely see the comparison with that. And, uh, and Zelda 2, I've heard. And... So this is, this is the whole town base where you know you do a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, this guy right here, gastronomer, he uh, gives you food. But you need a meal ticket to uh, get food from him, and when you do, the food you get from him uh, gives you another life bar. So we started with four, and I've gained already three so far. And this is the magic person, which I haven't done much with her yet. And this is the goat guy who just ate a piece of paper. <laughs> uh, and there's stuff down here. You know, just a lot of cool stuff. This person dances. Because I beat, uh... Yep. There's no skipping this, so... I'm gonna watch this whole thing. <laughs> there we go. And there's people to buy stuff in here. And there's there's a lot to do, you know. Um. So Shovel Knight, as in the name, he has a shovel instead of uh, you know a sword, axe, or a basic always weapon. And uh, he digs up piles and stuff like that. But yeah. So let's go do some stuff out in the world. So right here was um, King Knight, which is one of the bosses, and this was Spectre Knight. Um, the game is pretty much similar to Mega Man in that there's like eight or nine knights or whatever, and you fight them. And you go through their level and all that. It's a pretty, pretty uh, Mega Man-ish. So I did, you know, I decided not to do the first two because I think most people have shown that up, shown that off. So there's three I can do right now. I've started the Explodatorium, Plague Knight, uh, Treasure Knight, and Mole Knight. Um. Let's just do Plague Knight. Or Chivalry. So this game is pretty basic, a, you know, A, or at least I'm using a controller. A is to jump, X is to use your thing. B is to do that too, so I guess it's whatever you want to press. Um, and you have magic items. Uh, there's a fishing rod, which you'll probably see me use here. Uh, chalices, which hold fish. I think. I haven't used one yet. Uh, I got this, which is a bouncy ball that hurts stuff. Phase locking, which lets escape from all harm briefly for like three seconds or something. And then uh, that, which I use pretty much the most. <laughs> and let's go. So, pretty basic stuff. Dang it, got hit there. Uh, 
Uh, do it here. Whatever. Get away! So you see right there, I pogoed that guy, and that's where the DuckTales comparison comes from. Um, so yeah, right here. And you can keep pog pogoing when, you know, you hit these rocks and enemies. And there's other stuff. Uh, and these piles you can dig up and you get a whole bunch of treasure, which equals gold. And gold is used to buy all that stuff that I mentioned in the town. Uh, magical items, and meal tickets, and it is involved with, um, it's involved with the checkpoint system, which you'll probably see in a second. Dang it. Yeah, I'm not great at this level. Because I've only played, like, a little bit of it. And it is not... No! Ugh. Okay, so I died there. So I lose gold whenever you die, so... You know, it's... Kind of like Dark Souls, but not not even close, really. <laughs> so I have a chance to get, I think, all of that back. Um, just give it a try. Whatever, I don't care. Those those rats suck. Ugh, they're so annoying. You need to hit them at the right area. Dang it. Yeah, I'm not okay. Like anybody who follows me, you know how much like I've I've mentioned this before and all that. But I'm I'm awful. I'm awful at like Mega Man type games and Castlevania type games. And it's just the way I am. Like, I don't know why, I just suck at that. Um, but this game had me, you know, just interested. Screw you, right? <laughs> ah, dang it. That, that thing's really annoying. Okay. Um, let me pause here. So, I guess I want to explain a few things. And I kind of lost what I was going to explain. Okay. Well, we'll just fish, I guess. So, there's a sparkly hole here, which means you can fish. So, you can use an item by pressing up and X. So, I got a fish there. 350 gold. Yeah. There you go. For that. Uh, okay. Yeah, he exploded, but I guess it was kind of worth it. Because... Yeah. Okay, this is about as far as I've gotten. And... Okay, I could have gotten that stuff now that I think about it. I, I thought for a second I could get back. Um, okay. There's a lot to explain here. Uh, so the checkpoint system... It's a checkpoint, as it says. So the next time I die, I'll start here instead of way back at the beginning of the level. But I can break... Uh, these for gold, but I lose that checkpoint for the rest of the level and I think for the game. So it's kind of like a risk reward kind of thing. Um, I have yet to break one because I like my checkpoints. Yeah. Get out of here. So there's tons of secrets, like... Crap. Oh god. What are you doing? Okay. Ugh. No! Okay, got it. <laughs> uh... Yeah, it's good. Whoa. So yeah, it's, um... A pretty NES influence game. Uh, I don't even know what that is. Get away from me. I wouldn't say it's on the same difficulty as those games. Because I actually haven't died too much. <laughs> um, but it still gives you a challenge. 
Dang it! Okay, yeah, so I died. It's not, don't be surprised. Uh, I just, I just really have been liking this game, so. That's the way you're supposed to do it, I guess. I guess that's the way you're supposed to do it again. I love this place since I didn't go this way before. Various like secrets and stuff, which I think I touched on before I so rude, rude rudely and oh god, I suck. <laughs> okay, um, I kind of just want to show off a boss fight, so I'm just gonna skip to that. When I skip to that, but you know what I mean. Dang it! So right here, you get turkeys, which. And like uh, Castlevania, have a heal you. So wall turkeys and stuff. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I, you know, I don't know if I took my controller or something, but sometimes like when I jump, it doesn't jump. And sometimes when I press X, it's kind of eh. I think it is mostly to do with my controller. So. Nothing wrong with the game. Wow, I mistimed that completely. Holy crap. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm a little bit better than what I've showed so far. But, uh... <laughs> we'll see if, it, if I can change that. Dang it. God, I hate most crap. Yep, I kind of suck at this. There we go. I don't care if I miss some of my gold. Fine. Alright, this is going to be a tricky jump. Oh! Oh, oh! Keep, wow. That was kind of... I didn't expect to live after that. Nice. Got that. Uh, I'm trying to figure out the timing. There we go. Oh crap! Dang it! I I screwed up in the timing. Yeah. I didn't realize it until it was too late. So yeah, we go all the way back here. Checkpoints are not, you know, there's not like abundance of checkpoints, so it's not like, oh, it's so, you know, there's no difficulty, just checkpoints are easy to find, like, there's only like four or five per stage. And sometimes there are less than that if you destroy all of them, so, yeah. Got that. Dang, I hate. What are you? I don't even know what you are. <laughs> okay. We right, got for that. Dang it, you punk! Where are you? Like some bunny beast demon thing. I needed that because I was getting destroyed. Let's see if we can't make this jump. Nope. Mm. We'll see. Yeah, I don't think I can get that right now. Whatever, it's fine. What's that? Thing? It's like a, it's a spider, but doesn't even have a back anymore. It's just a hole. 
that. Thank you. Sweet. Yeah, so, you know, it's, it's just a fun game. Like, if you're a fan of just a classic game, you're gonna like this. Uh, it's been reviewing pretty well, too, so... Yeah, I actually got... I did not mean to get up here, but that really helped. Sweet. I did not mean to... Crap, I don't even think I can get up there now. Oh, I can't. Well, that's not good. Thank you. Yeah, enemies are kind of stupid. They will jump off of cliffs and stuff and just fall off, actually. But that's that's okay. So this game this game was uh, kickstarted. Um. I think it was last year, maybe before that, maybe in 2012. Um, yeah, it reached its goal pretty easily. And it's a game I've known about for probably the last year. And uh, I've been excited, you know, to get my hands on it. How are you? Whoa, leave me alone! Okay. Yeah, it's made by Yacht Club Games, I should mention. Oh yeah, here we go. I don't even think I had to beat this guy. That's, that's okay. Yeah, that pogo stick move is just so awesome. Yeah, I can just run past this, but I feel like killing this guy. There we go. I knew I screwed up the time there. Alright, grab that. Right, we got another fishing hole, we'll do that. So yeah, I was thinking about doing an LP of this game, but I just decided, you know, I kind of wanted to just play this on my own time. Eat me, knight. The Truple King commands me to share his bounty with you. All hail the Truple King, the king of fish and fruit. Long may his stem grow. Become invincible for 10 seconds. Great for those tough spots. Does sound pretty great. Probably save that for the boss. So I'm guessing this boss is all about poison or something. This is the plague now. Oh, crap. No, I knew a screw. Yeah, I never been. I never beat the other guy. So <laughs> these guys, these knights are all over, uh, and they kind of suck. I almost jump down there. Kick your ass. I don't know why you can't get hit by flames. It's not fair. Okay, I took him down, but I don't know if it was worth it. Wow. Yeah, there's no point in getting rid of my stupid money back. I don't care. You know what? Let's use this. I don't really need it. <laughs> but yeah, it's like I, I think I mentioned before, I don't take any damage if I use that. It's probably a good place to use this. Or use in this area. 
Yep. Dang it! Ugh. Okay. I want to get to this boss. We're so close. Yeah, I don't know. If, I don't know if we will or not because they don't plan recording too long. Just want to show off a bit of the game. I only show off a level. Oh crap! Oh, okay. Did it. I did it! Yeah, I don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Wow, that was... Pretty lucky. And I fall down again. Oh, oh, oh god. <laughs> I can't believe I grabbed onto that. We got that. Dang it. Okay, whatever. Let's get through this. Get to the checkpoint. Where are you? It's kind of freaky. I don't want to even get close to them. Okay, that works. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, secret. Nice. I needed food, so that was good. You know, sometimes you just kind of... Like, there's certain things where you know it's a secret in this game. Uh, and I guess that it was, it really isn't the level to show you since I'm getting like crap handed to me. There we go. I usually dig up everything because you never know what has treasure in it. I'm really low on health. That treasure. Okay. Oh my god, no. Ugh. It's not that easy of a game in my opinion, but I do I've never I never grew up in that that era of where everything was difficult and hard. Alright, we got more health this time. We should be able to get through that. Nice. Look at my skills. I paid the bills. I knew it was going to hit there, but I didn't care. Why does everything throw stuff in this game? Oh, I don't even know how I freaking did that. Quit throwing crap, you a-holes. Yeah, what now? You're down there. How does it feel, huh? Yeah, you just fall off. Let's fish again. Hopefully there's like health or something this time.
Master Angler. Sweet achievement. Alright, we're at the last checkpoint, I think. Eleven to forty. Oh, I didn't even notice this stuff. Okay. Let's uh, that out. I think we're at the boss now. With <laughs> one heart, <laughs> or one, one whatever it is. Heh! Leave me alone. Show yourself, plague knight. Your trickery will not stop me. Trickery. <laughs> The fruits of my research are no more trick, or no mere trick. Boom! Hee hee hee. Now let's have a lesson, shall we? I promise. He. You're stupid. I don't like you. It will be enlightening. Whoa! Ow. Yeah, I don't. Okay, <laughs> I did not expect to kill him at all. There, I had pretty much no help. So, yeah. there we go. Now this is the real fight. I think probably this will work best for this fight. And luckily, it skips the whole thing again, so you don't have to do that again. Ow. Oh, what is that? I don't want to touch that stuff, probably. Ow. Ow. There's a lot going on. Okay, we're pretty even at yeah, with health for now. Whoa! Pretty badass, man. Ow! Don't get hit! Come on, finish him! No! Oh, it's so close! One more hit. Like, one of my only grudges so far is, like, I'm not a big fan of the shovel. If, like, the shovel attack, the space shovel attack. Because it's not like a sword where it's, like, you kind of, you just have a natural feeling of what that's like. It's just different. It's kind of like, it feels like it's not exactly in, in the middle of the enemy. It's, like, kind of below it. No, it's hard to describe. Don't hit anything. Nice! There we go. Took him down. It's already the same amount of... That one boss is the amount of Mega Man bosses I have beaten. One. <laughs> and that was Chill Penguin. That's the only one I've ever beaten. Alright, so that is... Just one of the bosses and one of the stages. Um... Yeah, it's a fun game. If you have 15 bucks and you like classic games, uh, this is really worth it. It's for Wii U, uh, PC, and 3DS, and this is on PC, if I didn't mention that. Um, yeah. I didn't get my Wii U because I thought the Wii U gamepad would not be as fun to play this game on, that made any sense. And the 3DS, I just didn't feel like I had for that. Okay, so this is Number Town. So yeah, so that is uh, Shovel Knight. Oh, nice. 
We gotta check this out. This be the aerial anvil. Need an arm upgrade if you need something forged under fella. Har har. Five, drop half as much gold when you fall in battle. It's not bad. Sacrifice some protection for a higher magic limit and harvest magic from defeated foe. Perm two consecutive shovel drops to unleash a powerful charge slash. Interesting. Heavily plated keep your footing when stuck when struck by enemies. But stopping may be a problem. What? So, yeah, you don't get hit back when hit enemies hit you. Flashy, acrobatic, useless. <laughs> well, we need that then. We'll buy this. This red armor. Have a red. Sweet. Pretty awesome. My nice shovel blade you have there, lad, but I can improve it, unlock its true of it all. Take up a whole pile in one mighty motion. Slash the spark the ground when you're at full health. Hold your attack to unleash the Charge slash. Well, we got different armor. So, this is just a quick glimpse of what this game has to offer. Or not. I just said author, as in the author. Uh, okay, that's kind of weird. Um, so yeah, I, I'm liking it. Um, let me know what you guys think if anybody's picked up the game. Yeah. So I briefly guys watching Shovel Knight for the PC. Uh, thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys in uh, some other videos. Yeah, see you guys later.